Alright, so we're gonna roll this fender here today. It's, um, you know, it's gonna be painted, so this is the best time to roll the fenders. And I'll show you how to do it. It's kinda got a little trick to it, but once you know how to do it, it's not too bad. And it makes the fender a lot stronger on the edge once you roll over the edge. And um, then when you go to paint it, you don't have to worry about it getting scratched off. Just take your torch and just a normal body hammer. Uh, usually the flat side works the best. Smaller head is always good, like this. This tip, uh, that might be towards the end, I'll show you though. Then you heat it up, and then you hammer it. So. Don't want to get too hot either, but it's still got the same shape. I mean, this fender's kind of messed up, but we're gonna body it out here a little bit, make it better. There's a big dent up there, but it's got a pretty nice lip to it. It's not gonna catch your tire edge or anything. Smooth. I mean, you can cut up here too if you really want to notch it, but I prefer to leave it all one piece. Kind of keeps it stronger. So. Well, there's how to roll a fender if you're going to paint it, guys. So hit subscribe.